to make it this way, but no, but we go, go, go. And my father was telling me that I better be ready to ride on. Thank you. Nice, nice, so nice. Mmm. <laughs> Got it! Okay. Uh, I'm tall, you see. I'm tall. Maybe I seem smaller from the distance, but there is how perspective works, you know? I'm tall, okay? And, you know, when it's rainy and uh, all the people are with their umbrellas, umbrellas of the regular people are like here. <laughs> And when there is a group of old ladies coming uh, to me, it seems that they want to cut my head for some reason, you know? Because they surround me and uh, all these needles. Okay. The next brilliant joke is about child-free movement. Do you know anything about child-free movement? No? Child-free are people who don't have kids and believe that it's not necessary to have kids, okay? And uh, I was child-free. I was maybe the most child-free in Russia till the very moment when my son was born. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> so I don't need a lot of reasons to change my mind, you know? This is a joke. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, funny. Yeah. Yeah. yeah! Thank you. Okay, the next one uh, is about uh, a church. There is a church near my house, and uh, this is a very beautiful church. And there were some friends of mine coming to Moscow, and I wanted to show them that church. And we came to the church, but the security guy uh, stopped me, because he said, I was in shorts. And he said, no, you are not allowed in the church in shorts, because you know how it works. You come to church in shorts, God see your legs and uh, and, and stops existing. <laughs> So this is the reason why they don't allow shots in church. Uh, and we wanted to leave the place, but then the security guy said, no, no, stop, stop, come back. We have uh, a solution, we have a solution. We have pants for you. And uh, I wondered, and uh, he uh, described that uh, they have uh, pants for such situations. And uh, I just wanted to imagine these pants. No? They have pants for people who want to get to church so desperately that even the fact that they, ha they don't have pants doesn't stop them. You know, people without pants want to church and they, they have the way for them. And okay, fuck those pants and... Uh, <laughs> sorry. Sorry for that. Awful pants, yes. This is not the, the topic of the evening and uh, awful pants. Okay, I love porn. Uh, yeah. This is uh, a clean night, so there won't be any uh, wrong words. I just love porn, okay? Because uh, I think this is a genius form of art, how to show sex in the way it never looks in the real life. Never. Because I tried. <laughs> <laughs> Never. <laughs> Never. The porn is like a science fiction, you know? Like Star Wars. You just look at it and wow, so nice and fantastic, but it doesn't exist. <laughs> like, you know, just some fantasy, some nice, beautiful fantasy, uh, because it never exists in real life uh, like uh, three black guys naked and a uh, teen girl smiling. Uh, never. Uh, <laughs> it can never be. Uh, and uh, the fact I wanted to tell uh, you is uh, the problem uh, with uh, headlines. There are, uh, sometimes uh, in some newspapers or some uh, internet sites there are headlines uh, with porn stars. Like, porn star wrote a book, porn star met the president, porn star, mm -hmm. porn star this, porn star that. And uh, uh, there is always uh, a name of this particular porn star, and I always uh, check this name, and I can't recognize it, you know? And it's not my fault, because I know all the names, okay? And Kirill, maybe you are out of date. No, 
<laughs> I refresh this list <laughs> on a daily basis. <laughs> so the problem is in there, in, in them, because uh, they are not real porn stars. They are just porn actresses. You you need to work hard to get this title, porn star. You know, you need to work really, really hard, and uh, uh, just don't call you. Porn star, if you are just a slut. I, this is what I wanted to tell you. Okay, the last, the last idea uh, for today is, uh, uh, all you know, uh, the Jesus story, the story about Jesus and his uh, 13 friends, and uh, he had uh, the 13th friend Judas was wrong and blah, blah, and he killed uh, Jesus. And uh, I want uh, you to imagine a company of 13 friends. Yeah. Because uh, a few days ago I was in a company and there were just five friends, and it, it was already hard to to communicate. We were walking on the street and I was uh, saying something and I, I I needed to say it loudly, like ah, 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 and uh, they were just like what are you saying? And just five, and Jesus had thirteen. So I I mean there are too many friends. And uh, this is so big group of people that uh, some uh, some guys on uh, okay fuck this. Uh, uh, <laughs> have a nice evening. Uh, thank you. Woo!